Hello! Today we're going to go over Life Leech again. So, the reason we're doing this is because back during Challenge of the Horde, um, I had done a video on Life Leech and showed how it works. And then I was soloing in Challenge of the Horde, the weekly missions. There's a bunch of them if you want to see them on, on this channel. So, it got hard about like week six or seven, and I couldn't do it, and I was just dying. I was dying from bees, I was dying from piss. Nothing really changed. Yes, we had different modifiers every week, but I was just, it, I wasn't... If you look at the first videos where I was solo in it, it was it was easy peasy, like overpowered easy peasy. Okay, I was playing kinetic beats with a pulverizer with a 3.6% life leech. And if you watch the life leech video, you could swing through crowds, and every target you hit procked the life leech, like it should, like it should. Okay, you're getting health back for every time you hit something, not per swing. Um, if they were to do it based on per swing it should be a percentage of your health. That way it doesn't proc on every hero. But like every other game, when you hit something, you steal life from it, okay? So why is it that uh, if you hit one target, it would nullify it from the others? And so what I think happened during Challenge of the Horde, either some code came out and broke it maybe, or, or maybe they saw my video and they wanted to nerf it. I don't, I don't know. Um, but none of us really tested it and I've always had a theory that um, it got nerfed and it's basically only procking off of one target instead of every target you hit. So we're going we're gonna to verify that to see if I'm wrong. Maybe they nerfed the value of it. Maybe it's broken and it's not working properly. So we're going to run through and um, just verify what's happening with Life Leech. All right, so here we are in Hexylvania Evil before it's gone. The Ray. Mansions of Hexylvania. Shh. But we've got traps. Search the zone for castles with elevated storm corruption readings. It's rude. It's rude, Ray. It's rude. I was talking. So, we're going to be running the lead sled with 3.6% uh, life leech, okay? It's going to be hitting for 34,500 damage, which should be giving us 1243-ish health per swing or per, per hit. If it's still working as as it used to work, okay. Um, if we hit an elemental husk, it's going to be seventeen two six seven, and we should be getting six hundred and twenty one ish health back from from an elemental husk. All right, I got some elemental fire guys in front of me. Um, since they're elemental, my damage should be reduced. I should be doing around seventeen two six seven damage. I should be getting six hundred and twenty one ish health. Unless I crit, okay? So we're at 66,370 health. 66,992. 67,614. So, Life Leech seems to be working as intended. At least against the Elementals. Let's go find some, uh, non Ellie's. Some, some physicals, some unspecial, basic husks. All right, so we got some non Ellies. It should be hitting for about 34 and a half thousand damage, which should give me 1243 ish health back. I'm at 9770. Oh, wow. 9701 health. 91, 944. Yeah, looks about right. 93188. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so Life Leech seems to be working as intended, as I showed previously. The only test left is to test my theory that they removed the multiple procs. That's the only thing that makes sense on why I went from never losing health to getting pooped on. Alright, final test. Let's get these little... Uh, dynamic trio here down to the wall we're gonna smack all three it doesn't matter actually it does it does matter so um, I'll be hitting these guys for about 17 17,000 I should be getting 62 62 621 health back per hit unless I crit um, we're at nine ninety three thousand health let's get these guys grouped up they're gonna beat on my wall. Get all three of them here. 
Did they remove damage numbers? I don't know. But 93 to 95. Alright, let's do this. It's a perfect scenario. I got a bunch of husks over on an undefeatable defender. Defender? Survivor. Okay. So in theory, I should be able to swing through all of these guys, hit every single target, um, and I should be hitting at least 621 health per target. How many do we have in here? I have three fatties and a skinny. We'll just leave it three fatties. Oof. Oof. I have 43,000 health. So, I'm actually really surprised. Life Leech uh, appears to be working as intended. Um, there is one thing that I did notice that's different from the last video. Um, they're grouping your damage numbers together. So, when I do hit multiple targets, I get one damage number. Which makes me wonder if there was a period of time where, as they were changing how your damage works on melee, uh, if if Life Leech wasn't working. But as of right now, right before 7.0 launches uh, and the end of Fort Nightmares, um, Life Leech is working. It's just a little different now because instead of having each individual number from your target that you hit while you're cleaving, cleaving is a multiple hit while swinging, um, you can see, okay, well, that's a crit, that's not a crit, that's a crit, that's not a crit. I'm going to get this much health, this much health. Now it just lumps it all together. Um, I had some swings on those fire guys uh, that I didn't know were crits, but when you run the numbers, some were quit crits from the, the value of health that I got out of the, the combination. So it is working. It is working. Um, so that myth, partly from myself and from others, over the last couple months is definitely um, false, busted. It's uh, not relevant. Life Leech is working as intended, which actually makes me super happy um, because I, I am, I'm a hundred percent positive. It wasn't working this way in group in. Yeah. Yeah. I can't prove it though, because it's working now. So maybe I'm just being a baby and I suck at the video game, <laughs> but uh, yeah. For those of you that were skeptical or, or had been watching me struggle with Life Leech over the last couple months, um, and complain about it, it's, uh, uh, we can confirm that it's working, as intended, per hit, per hit, and not just, uh, per swing. So that's cool, that's good news, that's good news. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad. I was originally hoping that it was broken, uh, so that the video might promote them to fix it, but it's fixed. It does. It already works. It works. No, no need. No need. So, yeah, so just as a quick recap, if you have, if you're, if you're new, if you're new, um, life leech, uh, the percentage is correct. You do get 3.6% of the damage dealt by your weapon, um, which includes critical hits. It's not just a flat number. So whatever the damage is that you deal, you get 3.6% of that health back per target you hit. So all the factors apply. If you critically hit, you're going to get 3.6% of that critical hit damage. If you're fighting elementals, your damage might be reduced based on the weapon element that you have versus that elemental. Whatever damage number pops up on screen, you will get 3.6% damage uh, or health back of that damage number. Now, another thing to note that I just noticed is that they're clumping the damage numbers together. So if you cleave four or five husks in one swing, you're going to get one big fat number of the sum of all the damage done. So if you crit on this husk and you don't crit, it's not going to show that it's a crit. It's just one big lump sum white number. Um, and you will get all the appropriate healing benefits of that big number. Take that big number and 3.6% of that number is your health you're getting. So... With that, uh, just as a friendly reminder, I stream daily over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash slightgumby, uh, usually from the hours of 8 p.m. till about 2 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. It's West Coast United States, um, where a lot of these theories and myths and testing and tips and tricks are, are born, are born. And then when we have something that I've, I deem relevant, um, we make a video um, 
Again, like I said, I honestly thought it was completely broken. I'm almost positive it was. It's clearly working. So with that, I'll let you guys go. Hope that uh, clears some things up. Since it wasn't broken, go ahead and feel free to bitch at me down in the comments about how I wasted your time. But at least now you know it's, it's working. I know a lot of us were under the impression that it wasn't. So at least that clears it up. And on that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye now.